Triple H will have the size and strength advantage. Shawn Michaels can counter with speed, quickness, and heart. Not to say the game doesn't have heart. He's got plenty of it. And from the hatred that exists between these two men, I would expect this match to proceed at a breakneck pace, Cole. These two men have been waging a war with one another since SummerSlam 02, but now it ends here. Inside hell in a cell tonight. I don't think Shawn Michaels is content to get a simple run-of-the-mill win over Triple H tonight. I think he wants this to be a more final. I think Shawn Michaels wants Triple H to know once and for all that Shawn Michaels, HBK, is the better man. And that's what this is all about, King. Who is the better man of these two superstars? Oh, we're going to find that out tonight one way or another. Well, coming into the match, we talked about Triple H's undefeated record in Hell in a Cell matches. But Shawn Michaels has written some history in the cell himself. Indeed he has. HBK won the first Hell in a Cell match ever held, scoring an historic victory over The Undertaker seven years ago. He drops the elbow. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Triple H. He's putting those educated feet to good use. He almost took his head off with that lariat. Here goes Triple H. Oh! He took too much time, and boy, did he pay the price. Cole, you put it mildly before when you said Randy Orton's tactics on the road to WrestleMania 21 were slightly unorthodox. Yeah. If delivering an RKO to his own girlfriend live on Raw, as Orton did, is slightly unorthodox, then I don't want to know what extremely unorthodox would be. I've never seen anything like that. The resilience of Shawn Michaels is absolutely extraordinary. But the game is out to totally shut down that legendary will to compete of Shawn Michaels. And Triple H, even though he said he'd be in no hurry to finish Shawn Michaels here to the spine buster by the game. Uh-oh, look at this. Ow! Trying to put him away. Wow, well, what a move from Triple H. That's how you sweep an opponent under the carpet. Triple H is one of the most powerful men we've ever had here in the WWE. And Triple H, all that should do it right there. And Shawn Michaels' condition is getting pretty severe. But I'm afraid it's going to get even more severe. It's not like Triple H is going to let up for one second. Well, knowing the four years of hell that Shawn Michaels went through away from what he loved to do because of all his injuries and his surgery and then coming to hell in his cell and having this happen to him is more than ironic. Well, I hate to say that Shawn Michaels deserves this, Cole, but everybody out there needs to remember one thing. Shawn Michaels asked for this match. No, he didn't ask for it. He demanded it. Watch it. Oh, my gosh. Shawn Michaels tuning up the man with some sweet chin music. And looking to put Triple H away. And what has been an epic encounter. Oh, Triple H goes low. Oh, no. Low blow by Triple H. Perfectly legal, though, inside the confines of a steel cage. Oh, brother, Shawn Michaels is hurt. He's hurt bad. I don't know if he can continue. Oh, no, not a pedigree. That will finish off Shawn Michaels. The punishment. Both of these men oh! take it in the pedigree to Shawn. Good night, nurse. The exhaustion of both men as Triple H just crawls into the cover. And Michaels oh! kicks out an air fall. How did Shawn Michaels survive that? I don't see how either one of these superstars can continue. This is such a brutal beating. What's going to happen? He was one step ahead on that one. Oh! And now it is show-off time. Don't waste time gloating here. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure. He may get the three count right here. And there's the reversal. Nice, well-placed kick to the ribs. We know what this is. Oh, and he connected. Michaels connected. How much more can these guys take, King? Well, I don't think they're going to have to take anymore. If all Stone Michaels has got to do is get his arm draped across Triple H, and it's over. There it is. Here's the cover. He's won it. And now it's Triple H who powers out. What? Absolutely incredible. Oh, my gosh. Somehow the game survived. These two men have just beating the living hell out of each other. How much more can either one take or give? What is it going to take to win this thing? Does the game have the strength to deliver one more pedigree? Yes! Look at that, Cole. 
They're both down and out. Both men down. But for this match to be over, somehow, someway, one of them are going to have to get back to their feet. We wondered if Shawn Michaels could reach down tonight and get to the level of where he'd been before, years earlier. I think he's answering that question right now. Oh, absolutely. I don't know if Triple H would be able to survive this damning, career-altering ride through the steel-encased Hell in a Cell. Well, desperate men do desperate things, and I think for Triple H, who's capable of any kind of dastardly deed, the time may be coming for an act of pure desperation. Whoa! He's measuring. Oh, you do not get up from that. Can his opponent kick Three. out? Oh, look at this. Triple H has done it. Triple H has somehow survived this massacre. And here comes Batista, Randy Orton, and Flair. They're concerned about their, their partner, and rightly so. I mean, Triple H has taken the most severe beating I have ever seen him take, Michael. What an incredible match. I mean, both of these athletes just motionless. Yeah, I, it's safe to say that neither Triple H or Shawn Michaels will ever be the same again after this battle. Trying to gingerly roll the game out of the ring. They need to get him to the back and some medical attention. barely stand under his own power. They're, no, they're going to have to help him. Well, Triple H may have won this thing, but he certainly doesn't look like a winner right now, does he, Cole? Not at all. What an incredible matchup. Both of these men putting it all on the line. 